We are at 79th Street and Western Avenue, just a couple of blocks away from St. Rita's right now. I'm going to step out of the picture so you can see what we're looking at. This is the beginning of the procession, which should be getting underway in just a few moments. Uh, they have blocked off streets, uh, blocked off 79th Street here, and there will be uh, block traffic all along this route for about 30 blocks. Uh, that's where the hearse carrying the flag-draped coffin of Officer Conrad Gary will move, as we said, about 30 blocks along Western Avenue to 111th Street. There will be this solemn caravan of blue light guiding the way toward the Holy Sepulchre Cemetery. There, of course, will be the private burial service attended only by friends and family. Now, along the route of the procession, we expect to see people turn out to salute Officer Gary's service to the city and to the country. Uh, as we see just along where we are, there are about 10 Chicago firefighters uh, standing right in the middle of Western Avenue along 79th Street, uh, ready to salute uh, the casket as it goes by. And now the uh, procession has begun to move. Uh, you can see the first car is uh, making its way down Western Avenue. The sirens are now blaring, and you see the blue flashing lights, just a sea of blue flashing lights and officers along the way. There are people here uh, on the south side, uh, the alderman's office here, Matt O'Shea, uh, printed uh, placards and signs for people to hold up to uh, both convey their condolences and their respect for the Chicago Police Department. Uh, so the, as we said, the procession is now getting underway. And this will last for about 30 blocks. Then, uh, then they will head to the cemetery for the private burial service. During the funeral mass, uh, right afterwards, Eddie Johnson, the superintendent of police, asked the question uh, of everyone sitting inside that church, is there any greater calling than to uh, serve and protect your community? And certainly that is what we're seeing out here today, the respect for that calling, what uh, Governor Bruce Rauner called the noblest of professions, uh, serving and protecting a community as a member of the police force and certainly as we have talked about and as was referenced throughout today's funeral mass this has been a very difficult year for the chicago police department losing four members of the department in less than 12 months um, and uh, unfortunately this is a scene that is going to be repeated tomorrow uh, but right now the funeral procession is just getting underway for officer conrad gary for now, we are live on the south side. Back to you in the studio.